Hello everyone, Ace here with another video. Yes, I said everyone, not guys. I am trying to be more inclusive from this year on. So if I start doing guys instead of everyone, then I am definitely in my old ways. <laughs> You may be wondering right now, Ace, what the fuck are you talking about? The year has just started and I'm already babbling about some nonsense. Welcome to my channel. Bruh. Anyway, for real, I'm here to actually get serious and get down to the nitty gritty with you all. So, we have a little bit to talk about right now. So, the more important part of this video is going to be in the second part of it. So, I will put a timestamp about right here to what to go to if, you know, you want to skip all the first nonsense, you don't care about Warframe and all that. A little bit of Warframe chat. So, I am here to talk about something important as well as what we're going to start with. The fact that a recent, semi-recent video of mine blew up a little bit. By the way, thank you guys for, thank you everybody for all the likes and comments that I possibly got on this video. Y'all rock. I'm currently going to the video right now because I'm looking at the comments and <laughs> they're all the same thing. Down the line in order of the comments that are on this video titled, We Ruined Warframe, listed as a short. HUD is so huge, it looks like a mobile game. HUD is over 80% of his screen, might as well do the HUD meme where you can't see the game anymore. Lol. My fat black cat is getting in the way. Oh wait, that's not a comment, that's just him. They make a one. Anyway. Back to that. How can you see with a HUD that big? What the fuck is this HUD size? What happened? So many people come out on the HUD size, which I saw no problem with because I think a lot of people are used to gaming either really close up to their screens or they don't understand the fact that a lot of people have screens smaller than, I don't know, say 50 fucking inches. Realistic case, I have a small screen that I game on and to make matters worse, I sit a little bit farther away. I sometimes tend to have a problem with reading things from a far distance. This is just the way I play, the way my HUD size is, and all that. My answer to this has been a mix of different things, honestly. I've been thinking about going tame, where I am now, going straight up with just making it bigger, like the max size, and saying, you all did this. You all fucking did this. But rest assured and all jokes aside, I'm actually happy the video is doing as well as it's due. I'm, I'm actually happy about a lot of things that are happening with that. On my popular videos list, mind you, that does get very high. 1.7k views that stupid short is sitting at right now. What? What? Okay, and going deeper in, it's currently got 20 likes. 20 likes, that's... And this video was 13 days ago. I, I don't know if I ever had this at all for anything ever. But this video is currently my most popular video. Sitting at 1.7k views. 20 likes. And 11 comments. What? Honestly. Y'all can try. Was that even English? Y'all can talk on. I could talk all the shit you want, please, because honestly, with his, with as much support as this is getting, with as much traction that this is picking up, I appreciate it all. I love all of the support I am actually getting right now. It is, I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of blowing my mind. I am actually feeling really appreciative of what's happening right now. So there you go. Three, two, one. Why is it doing this? I'm getting stoned. Okay, I don't know why the space bar isn't working for Pauls anymore, but whatever. So, a little clarity for that opening part right there. Me 
my fiance and her brother were all like just doing missions together, just having fun. And I decided to make fun of the fact that I'm Corvex because he get her uh, her brother gifted me Corvex for like a Christmas present. So I was very thankful about that. Especially because I wasn't really going to make the grind for Corvex myself. I wasn't that interested initially. But after seeing what he can do now, I'm really happy that he got gifted me. I wouldn't have known how awesome he was if it wasn't for that. But, yeah, I, I was kind of just like... I think we were talking about Disney Channel or something like that. And I was saying like, my name is Kermit and I am getting stoned. Yay! Now, be warned, you will hear me, and probably only me, say things throughout the video. Because I don't think that my fiancé or her brother have it set up to be heard in other people's videos. So, it sounds like it's only me talking to myself, but I really am talking to them. This is the way. 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 <laughs> we have broke Warframe. So you know what I saw at the end there? I said we broke Warframe. That's kind of really what I meant. Because we have... I'm trying to remember off the top of my head here. We have a... Gauss, a Protea, and a Corvex all in a defense mission right now. You have Protea who can turn back fucking time and place bombs all over the place. Corvex who can set a trap at the cryopod for any unsuspecting enemies. And Gauss who can run around and beat the crap out of enemies. So that's why I was joking about the fact that we have a good teamwork going. That's what I was joking about. That's all I was saying. And let me show you now. Let me just scroll down for a minute just to give you all an idea of like what the chat is like. You can pause this video at any time to read what anything says. I told you what most of the comments said already. And I, I mean, if you do pause it and see, you'll see I got tired of saying the same thing over and over. And honestly, you can see the HUD in question. Now, I digress. Hold on. I understand what people were saying with, oh, the HUD is so huge, how can you see anything? Simple. I look past the HUD and I'm not paying attention to the HUD at all times. But when I am, it's because I'm keeping watch of mine and my teammates' health. I am a healer at heart. I pay attention to stats. So when I'm not paying attention to stats, I'm freaking out! Okay, sorry, that was the second time I freaked out this video. Anyway, the second part is... 10 times more important than that could ever be. Last year, I don't think I was being very fair to you all. I wasn't giving you the full truth of what was on my mind. And I think that comes with good reason. I think that um, I was just scared and worried to where the channel would go and worried to what would happen and what my fans would think of me and all of this. Life doesn't care. Let me elaborate. So I remember last year I said something like, well, actually it, was, it wasn't even last year. It was like years I have been saying the same thing over and over that, oh, I would keep doing better for this channel. I'd keep uploading more. I'd try to keep a, get a steady schedule. I would do my best to upload social media. And last year was a fairly busy year for me. And I'd get home from work all the time and not realize just how tired I was. And that I wanted to just enjoy my days off the best I could and for what I couldn't enjoy for my days off the best way to explain it is I always had intentions to do better for this channel do more for this channel now don't don't get me wrong this channel is not going away it's not going away anytime soon in fact I have visions that I'm gonna become an old man and name it like veteran gamer or something like that <laughs> I'm gonna become an old man and just be a fucking nasty old son of a bitch I think you can kind of see where I'm getting at here. So where I'm getting at is that I have been feeling really bad lately about my upload schedule and the things I've 
not been able to do like I hold on, let me just do something real quick. I am looking at my YouTube ideas list and the amount of things in here are fucking crazy. I have yet to do any of them. The funniest part is half of it is live streams, stuff I could already be doing with the time that I have, but I never really get around to it and I feel bad. And as for my videos, it's stuff that's really good ideas but I have yet to pull it out. I have yet to do anything with it. And I think a big portion of it is because I just, I can't anymore. I physically, well, not anymore, but I physically can't right now. I have too much going on. So I'm gonna tell you all outright, day one, what I have planned for this year. That's ah! fine. There is gonna be a lot I'm gonna be busy with this year. I'm I'm being so honest with you. So honest that I honestly forgot how to speak. Yes, I did catch my correction before. Those of you who are not new to my channel and have been watching for, I don't know, about a year now or so, you would know that I wanna have plans this year to move to Scotland. And God damn it, I'm gonna make it happen. I'm determined every chance I get. And Another thing I want to do is, I don't know when it will be, but my goal is by end, the end of the year, I want to get myself a setup in Scotland. I want to do something in Scotland. I, I want to be there where I feel my heart is. Because as of right now, I'm going to be honest, I'm living every day of my life pretty much depressed. I'm taking every single day with another step forward with another grain of salt every time something gets in the way and it just that minor inconvenience i don't know what that just was i think i was trying to burp and say something at the same time i apologize that minor inconvenience that would get in my way let me give an example this is the second year in a row i've thought about doing a new channel trailer or that i've thought about doing a new intro but in my mind, I don't have time to do it. This is like the third or fourth month in a row. I've wanted to post my videos to me and my fiance's music channel and post our music videos. Like, I haven't even gotten the chance to make them yet. I have had ideas of how to build them up and I've had these interesting stories planned, but I haven't been able to get around to it because I've been too busy. Because I've been running around the house or running around at work or running around outside doing tasks or it's been non-stop one and then by the time i get home all i want to do is relax all i want to do is talk to my fiance and nothing else it's so tiring and i don't know how much longer i can keep it up consistently i've already shown you guys more than enough times that i can't keep this channel consistently and had have life so, basically the long and short of what I'm telling you right now is, I'm going to be up front this time, but tell you the same thing, in that you shouldn't expect a consistent upload schedule this year. I'm going to be honest, you may not even be able to expect it next year, but I'll bang them all try. I'll see where things go, see where life goes. My boss at work has a saying. It is what it is. And so that's that's what I'm telling you guys right now. Whatever happens with the channel, whether it be a shit ton of more shitty shorts, or I give you a lot of live streams, whatever. I am gonna go with it the best I can. If I have a good idea, I'll do my best to follow through with it. I'm gonna be honest, I even have a fucking live DJing live stream I've been wanting to pull off. That I've been thinking about. But every time I hype myself up for it. The day comes around when I have the time to. And I have no energy. Or I'm not inspired. Or I just literally don't have the time to. It's. That's what I'm saying. It's consistently one thing or another. And I just. I don't know how much longer I can keep going consistently with it. For right now. I'm simply warning you all. That going forward. I'm always going to do my best to 
give you all the best quality content, to give you all content that, you know, really will brighten your day or make you feel better coming home from a shitty day at school or work or, you know, whoever may be watching me from wherever. It doesn't matter. I just, my end goal is I want to make people's lives better. If I were to ever get rich, I'm saying this now and you certainly can quote me on it. If I am ever to find a reality where I am somehow able to get rich enough, where I can spare money away like it's nothing, I'm going to use it. I basically be trying to become a new age Mr. Beast. I want to help the poor people. I want to help kids in need. I want to help pets find good homes. I, I want to do this. I want to do that. I want to build schools for kids in need. I want to give electricity to those that don't have it. I want to do these things because it makes me feel good and because it'll make someone else's life better and improve their life. This is the kind of stuff I've always wanted to do. And, you know, going forward, I may never reach that point or my channel gets big enough to even consider getting paid from YouTube, not even a little bit. So that's where I'll say, at least for now, this channel remains a hobby. And so I want you all to understand that where I love to make content and I love to want to put you guys first, sometimes life just comes first and job comes first and my fiance definitely fucking comes first and if I have a family with her, it'll come first and you see where I'm getting at. It's not a position I ever thought I'd be establishing, especially with as long as I've had this channel and I want to keep growing with this channel. Life time and time again just keeps making me realize how I gotta keep doing what I have to do for myself or I'm gonna be putting unnecessary pressure on myself I don't need to put on myself. Like, I've also been thinking ideas to upload for the PG channel that I have and I just, I haven't committed. I've been so busy or I've been so like out of it that it's either been one channel or the other every single week, or not even. There are some days where I don't even feel like uploading anything because I'm just so tired and drawn out and uninspired. And that is not the content I want to give you all. I don't want to have it just be forced. I don't want to have the content be like just thrown out there for no random reason. I want to be able to enjoy what I'm giving you because I feel like that kind of content is easier to enjoy yourselves. So I just wanted to make that very clear. I'll always be here in the end. I will always, always be here. I know there's going to be like a million other people. Go ahead, watch them. In fact, I invite you to. Everybody's going to have their cup of tea. Everybody is going to have their YouTuber that makes them happy. In fact, it's through doing that a lot of YouTubers actually found themselves best friends just from collabs. Just from meeting each other on this platform and talking to each other. So, you know, if, if you are a platform yourself and you've thought of doing collabs, that's never a bad idea. I've had friends in the past that I've thought of doing collabs with, but they just kind of fell off the face of the earth and we never got a chance to do it. The only person I think I've ever really collabed with, other than my ex-best friend who, like, blocked all the videos from has been my boy Tommy he's been there since the beginning and you know he has always looked out for me I will say like a club being my fiance but I mean let's be real I started an entire channel with her so that wasn't just a collab that was a whole entire life waiting to happen baby that that's something I'm always proud of and since I'm on this topic of the other channel, that's actually a good thing I, I want to harp on right now. So, me and her haven't uploaded any videos hardly to the It's Smith channel because of some complications right now. Don't worry, there's there's no problem with us. No problem with us whatsoever. In fact, like I said, she's my fiance. We're engaged. We're feeling good. We know what we want from each other. We have been planning life together. No, no, no. I, I really just mean like technical issues like... I'm the only one with a computer and, you know, we haven't really been that, that inspired to play Minecraft recently. We've been doing Warframe all the time and, you know, I'm, I'm kind of trying to get the idea around, I might be thinking about doing one soon, 
or trying to do one soon, but I've been thinking about doing a video using the Ace Mist account and do some Warframe videos together. I feel like those would be pretty cool to do. I feel like people might enjoy seeing those because of how, <laughs> how me and her are as a whole. But I'm just, I'm trying to think of how I'm going to make that work effectively. I mean, that's really all I want to get off my mind for this time, guys. I just, see, see, I'm in my old habit. For this time, everyone, funny peoples, I don't know, I'll, I'll work on it. <laughs> I'll try to, I will try to find a word that generalizes people because I want everybody to feel included on this channel. And I mean absolutely everyone, whether you're boy, girl, transgender, a, a cyber monkey, a fucking flying zebra, whatever. I, I, a goddamn toaster, okay? I want you to feel included too. If you're a toaster, I want you to feel included, okay? I want you to feel included too. I'm just saying. But with that set aside, everybody. Oh, I kind of like everybody. Yeah, with that, with that said, everybody, I want to keep that established that I'm not going anywhere. The channel is just going to slow down for a little bit. I don't know for how long. I'm going to try to get back to it in a consistent pace as fast as possible, as much as possible, yada yada. But for this time, everybody, I want you all to know that I'll always be here for you guys. I did it again. Fuck! I'll always be here for you, everyone, to try to make you laugh, make your days better. Put a smile on your face. I wouldn't I wouldn't say show my channel to your kids or your younger siblings. Leave that for my PG channel. <laughs> okay. That's what my PG channel is for. Do not show them this channel. I go on about a lot of different stuff you don't want to show. You don't even want to show your mother the stuff, okay? <laughs> All of that aside, please leave a like if you have enjoyed this video. It does help me out a lot. Subscribe if you are new to the channel and you want more content like this, as well as get to know what channel I'm... What channel? God damn, I'm really not the loop today. Fuck! <laughs> get to know what kind of content I'm doing in the future. Comment down below what you thought your favorite part of this video was. And please, 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 please don't be afraid to let me know how did this video make you feel? How... Do you feel after watching this video? Did it make you laugh? Did it make you cry? I'm sorry if I made you cry. I hate making people cry. Please, please don't cry. Please don't cry. Make me don't cry. I'm sorry. I said I would keep it serious. I I think that's just going to be something about me. I'm always going to be no for. I can't keep it serious whatsoever. I just want to make people laugh. I'm just a big clown. Why so serious? Like, comment, subscribe. And as always, I will see you all in... The next video or live stream. Stay in the lines, Junior. Papa Pirates! So, this is my little room space afterthought. Uh, this is how big my TV is. I can actually go get a, monitor, um, a measuring tape right now. So, I'm back. I couldn't find a measuring tape, but I did find this metal ruler. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna measure it real quick. Okay, so that's like 12 and we're already halfway there. Oh, that's scary. It's about 24. So, I want to say... <clears throat> well, it's definitely less than 30 inches of TV. So... It's probably about like a 24, 26 inch. And you can imagine... My HUD is about right there. But of course, hold on, let me let me just give you all a perspective, or what I think is a perspective. So sometimes I'll sit here. Here is where my head is right about. Or sometimes I like to sit right here on the bed. <sighs> and then that's about how far away it is. So, yeah, th this section of the video was to prove to anybody that was still doubting me for anything I said in my video. Um, if I was lying, I was not lying. I legitimately have a relatively small TV. More so the fact that I just sit farther away from it. And yes, I know before anybody says anything, 
I am aware about the fucking lack of supports with these. I am very well aware. Shut the fuck up. I went over a whole TikTok thing about that, okay? Leave me alone. I am happy the way it is. It has been here for about a month or so and hasn't fallen over yet. Fuck off.